Your Excellencies, distinguished members of Georgia Plastic Foundation, ladies and gentlemen, let me begin by thanking the Georgia Plastics Foundation for their invitation. I commend the president, my dear brother, Dr. Stanley Okoro, for his tireless efforts and enduring contributions to Nigeria and humanity. It is with deep regret that I'm unable to physically attend the event this evening. I was very much looking forward to reconnecting with so many sisters, brothers, and friends. Nonetheless, it is indeed a great pleasure to join you virtually at this great celebration of your profound contribution to our communities here in Georgia, at home in our country, Nigeria, and around the globe. I'm truly honored to accept the Distinguished Service Award I'm deeply humbled and equally overwhelmed by the decision of such an amazing group of professionals to recognize my passion. Yes, my passion, as what I do every day, is born out of the conviction that my life has to make a difference in the lives of others. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, although the world is gradually coming back to life, we are yet to defeat the COVID-19 pandemic. The pandemic continues to, to devastate lives and livelihoods, posing the greatest danger to the most vulnerable populations. I extend my heartfelt condolences to all those who have lost loved ones and wish those battling the disease a quick recovery. The ever-present threat of infectious diseases such as COVID-19 demand that healthcare workers continue to work beyond the call of duty. I would like to wholeheartedly thank our healthcare workers who have since the onset of the pandemic been at the front lines in the fight to overcome the deadly COVID-19 pandemic. Healthcare workers have sacrificed immensely, often at great risk, to keep our communities safe and healthy. We simply cannot thank them enough. It is against this background that we truly appreciate the work of the Georgia Plastic Foundation that has done so much to, uh, to offer education, medical and surgical care to the underprivileged communities around the world, especially in Nigeria. Such charitable and selfless services are highly commendable and deserve all support necessary, including financial assistance to ensure that the foundation continues to make a difference in the lives of those in need. What the foundation has set out to achieve is in line with the goals and objectives of the Nigerian government under the leadership of His Excellency President Muhammad Buhari, GCFR. I'm heartened to note that the foundation continues to keep at pace with and utilize new and advanced medical techniques to expand charitable services to those in the, vulner in the most vulnerable contexts. In this regard, it is essential that health workers are supported and equipped to deliver quality health care at all times, integrating innovations to fast track advances in the healthcare to promote health of the affected people and protect the health workers themselves. I wish to reiterate my unequivocal appreciation to healthcare workers in the United States, Nigeria, African countries, and all over the world for the support and care you provide to patients and their families to cope with health challenges and to lead healthier lives. Much appreciation to the Georgia Plastics Foundation for maintaining and bringing out the beauty of humankind through their unique craftsmanship. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, I must admit that I have been fortunate to walk a path of service for people in all walks of life. I am so happy to be in Georgia, hoping to make a difference to humanity, and I look forward to your support in this regard. I thank you for this great honor.